G'day guys, here's some handy shortcuts for your R36S running a fresh install of ArcOS. While on the main menu, holding down function, holding down select, releasing function and releasing select will turn the screen off while keeping the system awake. To turn the screen back on, simply press any button. This could be handy if you're scraping box art for long periods of time. To do a safe shutdown, hold function and press the power button. To access the settings, just press start. To get out of it, press B. Holding down function and pressing the D-pad up or down buttons will change the screen brightness. To add a game to favorites, simply select any game, press Y and a little star will appear. If you go back to the favorites uh, menu, it'll appear in there. Here's some shortcuts for emulators using the RetroArch Core, which will be most of them. You can fast forward simply by holding the function button. To toggle fast forward, hold function and press the left joystick in. You can pause the game by holding function and press A. Resuming is the same. You can quick save by holding function and pressing R1, and you can quick load by holding function and pressing L1. To restart the game, hold function and press B. To bring up the RetroArch menu, hold function and press X. To get out of the RetroArch menu, simply highlight resume, press A. To exit the game, hold function and press start twice. For Nintendo DS, pressing R2 will swap the screen between top and bottom. Pressing L2 will swap between single screen and dual screen. While the bottom screen is active, moving the right joystick will move the stylus around and pressing it in will act as a tap. Pressing the left joystick in will bring up the drastic menu. From here, you can quit safely. For PSP, pressing the right joystick in will bring up the PPSSPP menu. Here is where you would save and load states as well as change settings. To exit out of it, simply highlight continue and press B. To exit the emulator, hold function and press start. While in DOSBox, pressing the left joystick down will bring up the on-screen keyboard. Moving the left joystick will move the cursor and pressing A over the letter you want to select will enter it. To close the on-screen keyboard, simply press the left joystick in again. I think that'll do it for today. If you have any questions or comments, let me know down below. Otherwise, thanks for watching.